And breaking at six, a suspected gang leader dead and three hostages safe after a standoff at a Sandy Springs apartment. The situation forcing neighbors to evacuate. This is all unfolding at the area Morgan Falls apartments that's off of Roswell Road in Sandy Springs. CBS 46's Zach Summers is live there tonight where we've just learned Zach breaking new details about the suspect. Yeah, this man was wanted for some very serious crimes. U.S. Marshals confirming the man involved in this standoff was Gary Anthony Creek, a street name known as Hove. According to the ATF, Creek is believed to have founded a gang called Triple C, a criminal organization responsible for more than 40 murders and attempted murders in the state of Maryland. The agency had been offering a $10,000 reward for his arrest. That's what led agents to this part of Sandy Springs around one o'clock today. The 39 year old helped three people hostage as he barricaded himself along with the hostages inside a unit at Area Morgan Falls. He fired at officers only to eventually turn the gun on himself. People who live nearby stunned to learn that such a dangerous man was found so close to where they live. It's terrifying. Certainly when we have, you know, we bring small children here, you know, I'm a caretaker and so uh, so yeah, to know that something like this was going on uh, is yeah, very, very frightening. Um, I certainly hope, uh, you know, you think with the police being so close, something like that's not gonna happen here. But, uh, but yeah, I guess it's possible anywhere. Police still trying to figure out exactly how those hostages may have known Creek, but they do tell us that at least one of them may have been romantically involved with Creek, but did not know that he was such a dangerous man. Uh, they're interviewing that woman right now as we speak. Now, none of the hostages nor law enforcement were hurt during the exchange of those gunshots. Live in Sandy Springs, Zach Summers, CBS 46 News. Thank you, Zach.